of a bunch of people in Hawaiian shirts with coffee cups who are explaining why they didn't stream the past, Hello? The past three days. And oh, hey, what's up? So I've wanted to do this for, I'm live right now. Yeah. And since I can do it on Twitch, I can do it here. Oh, hey. I, people can hear your voice. And oh. I won't get banned. Well, how's it going, buddy? Good, good, good. How are you? Pretty good. Good, good. This, this is so fun. I'm on stream and I can talk to you finally again. <laughs> wow. Isn't this crazy, bro? I, I, I felt like, you know, it's been years. Um, Obviously, well, maybe a year, but yeah, it's been a while. Have they only been banned for a year? Yeah, I think so. Bro, it feels like it's been three fucking years. True. Uh -oh. Oh, oh, fuck, bro. Steven, Mr. Faraz, how are you guys? Hey, what's up? How you doing, buddy? I'm doing great, buddy. Listen, I got a question for you. Who the fuck is Faraz? Aren't you Tyler Faraz nickname? Uh, no. Uh, how'd you get that information? No. <laughs> Don't worry about how I got it. I got a question for you, Destiny. <laughs> I got a question for you. Since you're a bisexual man, I think you're the perfect person that I should ask this question. Wait, are you bisexual, Destiny? Yep. Yes, he is. Can I ask you this Trust question, me, Destiny? Oh, wait. Whoa! Please. Don't cut me. Let no. me ask my question. Prontos, first. Prontos. Wait, wait. Hold on, please. I gotta ask this, bro. I really gotta ask this. Go Destiny, can you like be honest here, okay? And this isn't a gotcha moment, okay? Um, uh, well, that, that'd be super ignorant of me if it was a gotcha moment. I, I, I'm actually curious, okay? Have you given head to another man? Jesus Christ! Well, I'm not well, gonna I'm, be your fucking sexual fucking outlet right now, okay? Well, I'm just no. I, I'm just curious, like, like how to. How does the how does the shape feel in the mouth? <laughs> Quan, Quan, I'm just tell us what did you want, buddy? Okay, okay, okay. This is what I wanted, all right? Yeah. Which one to you looks better? Be honest. A vagina or a dick? Um, I I don't know, dude. That's no, because I've been called a homosexual, which is haram. I've been called gay multiple times because I said penises look better than those open wounds 100%. well cut penises cut penises right no no no, no 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 absolutely i do agree circumcised penises are superior 100 percent. but 100%. honestly as, as somebody who despises you know the the fucking ant eater shit you know uh, uh -huh. disgusting stuff i would still take those over vagina think about it if i disagree is open wound how? no 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 because listen are, i will right now okay i'll tell you right now you ready for this so yeah. i do think a so first of all, not all cut penises are superior. There are some weird looking cut penises, right? I think if the doctor had good taste, which, you know, I guess that's the wrong word to use. Jesus taste. Christ, yeah. as it's he's cutting doctor. out this little dick, like, oh, no, 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 he's absolutely in 18 correct. years, no, no, no. this guy's dick is no. going to be banging. Yeah, no, he's like, if, something right now. if the doctor is good at what he does, right? Like, ignore the bullshit, like, just objectively, uh, he cuts the penis correctly, right? Like, I think a cut yeah. dick is more superior, but there are certain cut dicks that, you know, from what I've seen, you know, that, that, that aren't, you know, as, as uh, aesthetically pleasing, right? Now, uncut dicks, right, they look like a mix between a sock puppet and an anteater's fucking snout, right? So yeah. I would argue yeah. that there are, see, the, 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 this is a spectrum, that's the problem. Like, the way you're looking at it, uh, Carantos, is you're looking at it as a black and white thing, right? But in my opinion, it is a spectrum. So I would put... Nicely cut penises, you know, uh, uh, you know, in the at the top, right? Below that, I would actually put a nice vagina, right? A nice vagina. But, but, goes no, no, no. Think about it. How where are nice vaginas? If if you were to take the whole like male population versus female population, you'd find nicer dicks, more nicer dicks than nicer vaginas. Yes or no? Yeah, but I feel like we're generalizing based on some anecdotal evidence, right? Like I, I don't think so. I mean, no. Uh, let's be fair. Like I have. 10 plus years of research into this and from the thousands upon thousands i'm a penis connoisseur at this point i've studied the craft from the thousands upon thousands of penises and vaginas that i've seen i'd say 90 to 95 percent of the time the penis looks better and i don't think you could argue against it hmm. because like okay no I'll, I'll give you this i'll extend this olive branch too. okay 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 fine a nice vagina is yes. better than a nice dick always Always, like you know, like a nice looking vagina is 10 out of 10 times way better than a nice looking dick. Like the perfect circumcised dick where, you know, the circumcision, the circumcision doesn't look like somebody cut it with a samurai sword. You know what I mean? So yes. it's like a nice vagina will always win. But most times it's super hard to find a nice vagina. But let me ask you this. Are you the type of person that likes it, you know, trimmed or do you like it bushy or do you like it clean? I'm talking about 
vaginas right here, not pubes. I would say I like it completely shaved. Okay, see, I'll, I'll, no, and I'll show you. I'll show you this. With penises, most of the time it doesn't even matter. It doesn't matter if it's shaved or if it's non-shaved. It could still look good, but if you like vaginas, right, and the way they look, if it has hair, it's already fucked. If you like it clean shaven, you know what I mean. You get what yeah. I'm trying to say? So it's yeah. like, it's it's objective. I think any man that says they think vaginas look better than penises is gay, 100%. <laughs> They're overcompensating for something. They're trying to hide something. You know how many times, you know, as a straight man, people try so to call me homosexual. It's Destiny, ridiculous. Can I, Destiny, can I ask you this, bro? Yeah, dude, ask away, man. So if you're not comfortable, you can pass. But like, <laughs> we go back to the dick sucking question. No, no, I, I, no, no, I, no, don't no. be a pussy. Go, go ahead. No, no, I'm not. Listen, no, no. Why don't, don't just ask like time. Austin or some shit? Doesn't he do that shit all the time? I, I did ask him. What I, did he I say? asked him when I was. Uh, he said, I forgot what he said. He said it's nice or something. Like, I forgot what he said, actually. I was in the car with him, and I asked him that question. Like, I forgot what it, what it was. And I think Austin does the fucking. He doesn't get fucked. Okay. Not just like Destiny, I think. I don't know. Don't ask me. Well, no, no. That part, ask, I don't want to know Ask the question, that. though. Ask the question, Yeah, though. I'm, I'm just wondering, okay, like, do you, okay, let me ask you this, then. Do you prefer a cut dick or an uncut dick, Destiny? When, like, I'm going to be when, totally when, honest. I... I feel like aesthetically, I can understand like cut dicks, why they look nice, but I prefer uh -huh. uncut one million percent. Whoa, why? Like, okay, so here's the staring. issue, okay? I'll, so I'll say this, okay? For the longest time, there's something that women do that drives me fucking insane, and I don't know why they do it. When a woman is giving you a head, she'll put her hand at the base of your dick, and she'll just kind of like squeeze it a little bit, and she doesn't actually move her hand. And I'm like, I don't know why you think this is effective or what the fuck you're doing. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, ever since As I've been now with a few, with, since I've been with a few dudes that have circumcised dicks, I totally get it because I don't know what the fuck you're supposed to do with your hand with a circumcised dick. I have no idea. It's Wait, weird. Wait, are you circumcised or uncircumcised? I am uncut. I'm an anteater, my friend. Whoa. But when I, when you've got a guy with a circumcised dick, like you put your hand in it, it's like I, I feel like if I move it up and down, I'm gonna like rip his dick in, in half. Yeah, I don't know what to do. But if I've got a, like an uncut dude, oh, I just put it and I squeeze up and down. I know exactly what I'm supposed to do. It like makes sense oh, one but million use percent. Lube or something. Use yeah, but I don't. No, no. I don't want to bring out like a fucking sex kit to just like. You don't need have... lube. You don't need oh. lube. No, no. All you have to do is listen. All you have to do is just choke on your dick one time, and any <laughs> gag spit creates the lube for okay, it. That can't be real. I'm a virgin, so That's I can't speak real. too much on this, but come on. That huh? can't be real. That's yeah, like bro. Pornhub quality shit right there. No, no, gag spit is like a mixture of fucking, uh, 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 like, sinus fluid and fucking spit. It's going to create the perfect but fucking what if she, no, but what if, no, 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 think about it. Though. What, what if she can't do that, though? What if she, she can't get past the tip if you're, you know, packing then, like that? You know what I mean? Then fucking sp just spit on it, and you fucking jerk that yeah, cock up. It gets dry quick. Come on, you know what It that does. Is. You... That, that's why I have to keep sucking. Everybody but the knows spit's the only a, a uh, uh, it, it replaces that for maybe a second or two, right? So you, you spit, you jerk off like three or four times, and you go back to sucking it. Bro, and then she once have again, to fucking juice up every 10 seconds, then that wouldn't make any fucking sense. Like, she have to drink water, then suck, drink water, then suck. Because, you know, yeah, you well, only if, spit so many yeah, times but if, in a minute. Right, but, but, but if that's the case, then the blowjob isn't of, of, of superior quality. So at that point, you just do it long enough until you stick it into the pussy. Uh, but at that point, it's so tedious. Like, oh my god! Like she's sucking there for like fifty minutes, and you're not even that hard. It, it kind of no, hurts. No. It's annoying. No, no, no. Usually, listen. Usually, most of the time, unless you're on some sort of drugs, the or unless you have some sort of nervous tendencies that uh, you know, a stage fright or whatever the fuck. In this situation, I think you understand the relative the relativity of that. So, realistically, you're hard before the blowjob even begins, right? Like, unless like you have you know that kind of nervousness. I got a question right? for you. No, no, I got a question for you. Do you? Show your partner your soft penis. Yeah, who the or fuck cares? Yeah. No, yeah. No, 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 it's a big question. Or it's you go not there a big already question. like semi hard. Oh my no, god. No, because some people are grow. No, no, check this out. Some people are growers. Some I'm a grower. Show off if I'm really cold, We're all growers. No, I'm an ultra okay. grower. If I'm like super cold, or if I'm just like whatever, my dick is literally like a fucking mini dog dick. It's like less than an inch long. My dick is mm. almost non-existent when I'm. Oh my soft. god, you're a micro penis, Andy, at the soft stage. Yes. An actual wow. micro, it's like a Christmas okay, tell, light. Tell us when you're hard, how, how big is it? Uh, seven, seven and a half for Destiny. I wish. Get the fuck out of here. It's a little bigger than average, okay? A little bigger than average, I'll give you that much, okay? If you so, wanna so, if you wanna so, buy so pictures for me, you can look up Molina's fans league, go send her a thousand bucks, I'll send you pictures, okay? Oh, no, I can't do that. You know, like, if I know somebody, Yeah. so like, I, on, on Twitch, like, I watch Manuel Ferrer, I can't watch his shit. 
Like, there's no shot. Like, Wait, like, I just Destiny, can't. is there like a... Do, do, do you have videos of you just fucking beating cheeks? Um, I mean, <laughs> maybe. Yeah, what do you mean? <laughs> Jesus. That's just so nasty. Well, I'm just wondering, like, do you have videos of just like going to town, both legs and your shoulders just fucking... I don't know if it's from that angle, but yeah, of course, me and Melina record shit. Damn. Oh, wow, well, you were not joking. I thought you were joking. You actually, like, I can see your shit right now. You're full on, huh? Well, wow. I mean, not unless you're in my fucking phone, Jesus. No, but I don't need to be on your phone. I just need to be on OF. You no, not, it. no, shit, we don't post boy-girl stuff, Jesus. Ah, so it's not on OF, so why are no. you trying to lie to us right now? I thought it was already there. Well, because okay, you post trend. stuff for friends for and it, shit. What do you mean? Oh, Jesus. Wait, you no, sent it to your friends? I'm not going to pay for it, bro. I, like, I'm somebody that... Here, here's the issue, okay? It's kind of like the issue I had with Manuel, right? Like, mm. before I could watch Manuel, but once I become friends with him, I can't watch it anymore, that, right? Okay, there you go. Yep. So, like, I, I know Destiny. I can't, like, watch him fuck. Now, if me and him are, like, in a room together and we're both fucking... I could watch him fuck. I could look to my left and see him beating cheeks. Whoa. I'm cool with that, right? Okay, Sneeko, relax, Sneeko. Hold up oh, now, buddy. Jesus. What the fuck do you mean you'll stand in the corner and watch your friend beat? Oh, I didn't say God. stand in the corner. I said both of us are fucking two chicks, right? And I look over and he's clapping a chick. Like, I can do oh. that. But I'm not going to watch his porn. Does that Will that turn you on even more, though? No. Okay, will now, you Eiffel Tower with your friend? Yeah, I've done it before. Well, really? You're not lying to me. Yeah, in, in college, I had a friend named Kyle. I've told the story on stream all the time. And there was this chick that was blowing me. And he just walked in. Man, I, I remember I looked over. Like, he walked into the door. And the way he, like, came in was, like, this, like, just, like, this ogre wobble. And I just look over. Like, I remember getting head. And this chick's just sucking my dick, right? And I look over like this. Like, I move my body. I look over. I just remember seeing this, just, I've ne this massive whopper of a dick. And he's just <clears throat> wobbling with it, right? Each step he takes, the dick just fucking flops. And I remember she just like, she's like holding my dick and she looks back, she's like, put it in me. And then he just, he just starts hitting it from the back and she's just sucking my dick. And I think he was too big and she's like, okay, I'm done. And she like uh, kicked him out and then she, she just finished me. So it's happened before. No, but be honest, be honest. Did that yeah. shit turn you on when she was like, put it in me and you saw that big fat fucking penis going inside of her? Did that, did that, did that <laughs> click something in your head? <laughs> I think you need to go jerk off, brother. I think no, you no, go. no, 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 you just, bro, did you hear the way you fucking described it? Yeah, well, I'm, I'm straight, but even I was like, yeah, damn, you know what I mean? You get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, because that idea where if you look at another dick and think, oh, that, that's a nice looking dick or that's a big dick, that somehow that makes you bisexual or gay, that, that idea itself is backwards. That's the issue, No, right? but I'm not saying, no, no, you're getting me wrong. I never say yeah. you're gay. I, mean, I, I never say you're gay. You could still, okay, okay, this may sound weird, but did you yeah. ever get a boner from taking a picture of your own boner and looking at it later? No. Why? So what, why would I get a boner for my own boner? No, but, no, okay, okay. Would that make you gay? That's a good question. I don't know. Think about it. Think about it because it's a penis, but it's your penis. How does it make you gay? No, because... If you it, have a really good... Okay, go on, it, go on. It, 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 it depends. If it's your own penis and you know... If, you, if, it, if it's your own penis and, your own, and you know it's your own penis, right? Most likely you can remember the time you took the picture and then what happens is you remember why you had a boner at that time. Maybe no, that would No, that's involved. an excuse. No, I'm not. You're tr I don't cope no. like that, okay? I that's, take that's, the tail as that's, it. No that's, not an, that's not an excuse, right? You remember the time you took the picture and what caused you to have a boner in that time and that might get you hard. But realistically, right, if you just saw, like the, the only way that it could mean you're into dicks as if you forgot that that was a picture of your own dick therefore you're okay mind okay that, that's a that's a okay that's that's not even an option right here I yeah if, like, yeah like i you could, could like if there was a lineup of dicks i could select my own it's it like i could never forget my own penis but that means you don't have an attractive penis you like we agreed there there's ugly penises and there's good no no, no. Penises. i have a very nicely cut cock then then you then why aren't you getting a boner to your own cock if it's that beautiful it doesn't even make sense. Think about it. It makes it's complete like, sense because no, it doesn't. Yes, and you're not does. gay if you do. By the way, you're not gay if you like I don't, you picked up your own yeah, shit. I don't. I don't care if I would if that would mean I'm gay. I'm no, you just people. told me to go jerk off because I said that, and I'm telling you that's I'm not. No, no, gay, no. Uh, I I told you to go jerk off when you uh told me if I get hard for my friend walking with this big cock and but saying. But you fucking Eiffel towered with him. You know that's like top two gayest things you could do of all time, other than you know. Then I guess fighting. I'm gay. Are you gay? I guess so. If that's what makes me gay, if Eiffel Towering a chick makes me gay, then yes, I'm gay. If that's okay, your standard, okay. it's then... only gay if you held hands. Did you hold hands? Did you maintain eye contact during any time where your penis was in the same 
Uh, have you, for have lack a of a better term, awesome socket, mirror is the better question. Or woman mm -hmm. in this instance, right? Did you ever like look at him in the eye? I did not, unless you mean the single eye. Then yeah, I looked at that motherfucker. That thing was a huge oof. fucking cock. <laughs> oof, 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 oof. That eye stared right at me. He's like, "Hey, I'm about to go in on this pussy, man." You know, sit back. No, no. Was it girthy as well? Was it like one of those like, like? No, I'd say it was shit? like it was like an eight inch dick. I would say. Ah, like, come on, eight inch. Like I got eight inches. It's not that big. I'm yeah, talking about like 13 inches, you know what I mean? No, no, it wasn't 13 inches. Like those inches. monsters were like, yeah, like, no, like this no, is no, illegal. No. You should, you, that shit needs to be removed when you're boarding an airplane type, you know? Yeah. That, those that, are the ones I'm talking about. That's got to be like a product of like, you know, some sort of like nuclear reaction, you know, some sort of like, you know, radiation 100%. hit and a, a third arm grew in the pelvic area. You know what I'm saying? Like that's ridiculous. 100%. Like 100%. No, the girthiness is it's so fucking ridiculous. So let me it's ask so you this, right? So are as well. are oh you God. a virgin uh, because of... Yeah, 100%. No, because of religion or why? Uh, yeah, because of religion. So let me ask you this. Uh, in America, there's a loophole with certain religions where uh, instead of, you know, f f uh, losing your virginity by fucking in the pussy, they fuck in the ass. So have you ever thought oh, about no, fucking... No. Have you, you fucked a chick in the ass okay. to bypass you that? About, you're talking about soaking. That's uh, the Mormons. That's their loophole in Utah. No, he's not talking about <laughs> soaking. He's just talking they about... They jump on the bed and they, they, the woman no, just no, no. lay still. <laughs> no, no. No, no. There was, a school, there was a school in California. I think it was in like Westlake Village or Thousand Oaks. It was like some... Uh, uh, Catholic, like, or some, it was called like something Lutheran, and I, I remember like the chicks there, the and the dudes there would the say, church, by the way. "Okay, well, it's whatever." Mormon. The people that do the ass stuff is Mormon. Like uh, Catholics don't do that, unless you know they're just you know having sex out of wedlock, which in itself is a sin. But in Islam, because I'm a Muslim, right? In yeah. Islam, there's a uh, um, there's this thing that some people try to cope with. It's called muta, right? And it's like a temporary marriage where you marry somebody just so you could clap cheeks now again this is how i'm right so i don't deal with it but again i'm not like i am listen the greatest schoolman in this call is destiny by far right but i'm not too far away from like that level of like cool like coomery but at the same time you know i'm not that why do they call that why, why do they call destiny a coomer he bangs everything with two legs you know what i mean like it's, it's kind of ridiculous the guy is a the degenerate sex addict. I mean, you could ask him. Destiny, you you love having what sex, I'm, right? I mean, I'll be honest. What, what I'm more curious about for Destiny, like, I want to know what he does when he's getting a good blowjob. Like, like what, what kind of like? Because I, I can't picture Destiny as just like, oh fuck you, suck that. Dick. I can't picture him like talking like that. Like, like what would he do? Like, oh, to my analysis, if you if you move the perfect to a 64 degree angle, <laughs> I mean, like, I'll reach an orgasm in three, four, oh, five seconds. You know what I'm saying? Like, would that be it? You know what I'm saying? Like, if you move your head to a 60 degree angle, I'll, I'll reach an orgasm in three, four, when he busts a nut, gotcha. Good job. Best you thing to do is turn them around so that they can't see your face, and then you pull out your phone and you do your emails while they're doing a blowjob. Okay? That's called being <laughs> That's efficient. That's what I'm saying, bro. I it's called being efficient with your time, emails. okay? You're for sure you doing the emails, the most efficient bro. nut possible. No, but like, do you like... Oh, let me ask you this question, Destiny. Did you ever yeah. sleep with a woman that could pick you up? <laughs> Stop uh, it, bro. Yeah, at least a couple. No, I want to know. Like, your, yeah. your pickup size. Oh, my God. I was about to say I want to see that, but I don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. But like, well, I mean, I've never had somebody like, pick me up while we like yeah, had but, sex but, before or something. Like, how on the wall, like, walk, 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 like, I do. Oh, 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 so oh, are you talking about like his legs on her shoulders, and then he just, she just like, he mouth yes. her from the wall? Yes, it's like but it's like she, the WWE she does move the type. Yep. She does the yeah, movement. No, no, though. she does the movement. She just pins his ass on the wall, and he's basically like sitting on her shoulders. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, yeah I haven't done it before. I mean, I'm sure Melina could do it if she wanted to. Whoa. You tell me she's that strong? God damn. Molina's fucking you strong, that dude. Molina's pretty strong. Huh. Wow. So, Destiny, I'm going to ask this. No. What's your uh, most preferred position? For sex? Yeah. Um. Have you ever heard of prone? What's that? Prone. I'm assuming that's it's when... It's like when you do... Is she laying flat on her stomach? Yeah, while doing doggy, basically, yeah. I think that's... Yeah, so she's she's flat on her stomach, and then you like kind of put your arm... Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Isn't that called a starfish? No, no starfish would be on her back. No, just... star... no, starfish no, would be on her back. Starfish, on starfish her is to describe somebody that's being lazy, not doing anything. Yeah, but in this instance, she's not doing much. Well, no, I mean, no, in missionary no, she, and whatever, in most is, fuck positions, is, there's not is. much a woman could do, right? I mean... Well, to be fair, she is setting the mood when, like, like you know, I mean, if she's getting to that prone position and you're hitting it from the back while you're both flat, like, sure. technically... I mean, in doggy, she can move, or if she's riding, she can move, but, like, generally, I mean, like... 
But missionary, or, I'm sorry, uh, star fishing is just generally used to describe a woman who's just not doing much in bed. She just kind of like lays there and lets you do it. No, like a dead corpse, you know, like you yeah. know, being a necromancer. Jesus, yeah, Jesus I get that. Christ. No, no, but let me, let me, let me ask you this, Trey, since you brought it up. Do you do anal? Uh, no. Uh, so you ask the religious, I'm assuming you're not religious. I'm not. I believe in a higher power, but I don't, uh, you know, have a religion. So it's the cuck take. I'm in the middle, but you know, there's something out there. That's fair, right? Well, I just ha I just wasn't like raised religiously. I was just given the option to choose. So I guess I'm agnostic. Yeah, okay, so you're agnostic. Super cringe. So what is true? Just be a super cringe. It's super yeah, cringe. Be an atheist. Just be an atheist. Be an atheist at this yeah, point. Yeah, you know, be an atheist Fuck at this God, point. Dude. Yeah. Be uh, the, the, well, well, maybe the there up. might be a god, but I don't actually you know. Believe uh, we, no, no, let, Destiny, you yeah. believe we came from like something as tiny as a single yeah. atom? The entire oh. universe came from. So that, what so do stop you believe, it. Destiny? It was just, it was, uh, what do you believe? He believes in science. We're all stardust. Oh, yeah. This guy over here yeah. thinks that some fucking guy up in the great above is watching you fucking jerk your little pecker yeah, off. Yeah, because okay? if you and then he judges you. <laughs> if, if you. If you were to look at this universe and everything that is completely dependent on something else, you're telling me that there isn't a higher power that everything is dependent on? Come on now. At the end of the day, listen, at the end of the day, you believe mm -hmm. in science that is based, ever changing. Based. Right? What you believe today could be completely wrong. What I believed 1,400 years ago is always wrong. <laughs> That's strange how that works, listen, huh? Listen, yeah. listen, listen. The problem is you've been raised in some Catholic Bible study school, and they mistreated you. Uh, like you, you know how how you know how them Christians roll. Unfortunately, you know what I mean. Shout mm -hmm. out to the Pope and the shuffling of all of them uh, priests, or you know, shout out to those people. But check this out: if you actually did an any bit of research into Islam, you'd find out that it's the truth. Oh my God! But your heart is closed off to it, not your eyes. Uh, you love to stare at a lot of stuff. You're ADHD as hell. But your heart is closed off to the truth. Damn. And that's okay. Rough. You're 35, 4, 35. 34 years old. I got time to get you there. Know, you have, like, this is, like, if you were to look in the mirror, you occupy the body of a 10-year-old, right? Do I? So you, like, technically, you're like, you know, you're, you're still a child. So you have a long time ahead of you. Huh? Speaking of children, where's my son, Jonathan? Where's Jonathan Zerka? Because I see him coming Jonathan. here. Somebody... Somebody sent me a clip of Jonathan crying about me bullying him, and he was tweeting me, "Look at this fake Muslim!" Like he was so mad at me. I, like I prepared the letter for him. I want to read it out to him when he's here because I feel bad. I, I didn't mean to bully him. I like Jonathan. He's a nice guy. <sighs> wait, 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 what state do you live in? Who? You, Quantico, or whatever the fuck your name is. Okay, you know my name. You keep calling me Muslim guy. Guy, uh, wait, call me cute. I have never that's, called you terrible. What? Aki, you have never called me a terrorist, okay? But, you know, you just hey, called Destiny. me at this point. Not, is the, Destiny, is this not your friend? Well, he, he's like a new acquaintance, okay? We're testing him out. Who the fuck is this, then? He's trying to... Like, one of these calls? Trying he's, to not, he's trying out for the what, Orbiter Club, okay? We're seeing how it's going, all right? Who the okay, fuck is okay. this? Okay, Mr. Nicknam, I'm in my interview. You're kind of fucking me up right now, okay? Who this, the this fuck is this? That? I thought this was your friend! <laughs> He's close well, enough. He's... What made you think we're friends? Yeah, I don't have any friends online, Train, okay? Because, because you have power to come in this call! Knut, what are you doing? <laughs> I was just joining into hear what uh, you guys were talking about, and I heard this accusation of being terrorist, and uh, I was speechless. Yeah, well, what's Listen, up? As long as you don't make anti comments, you'll be fine, alright? Yeah, careful. No, I, I, don't, I don't live, I don't live uh, in the US. I, I told you I live in Malaysia. Oh yeah, fuck, that's right. Like, well, you, everybody thinks I'm American just because I know all 50 states. It's kind of fucked up. No, we're just Americans, so we didn't know Malaysia had internet. Listen, if you know how to speak English, you follow U.S. politics, unfortunately. You know, you got to follow the world power. Because at the end of the day, Bro. what happens in America translates to the rest of the world. Just like what happens with Bitcoin translates to all the other altcoins. You know what I mean? America is the Bitcoin of the world. And soon it will Bro. crash, inshallah. No <laughs> way, Bro. Not. You're bugging. Bitcoin's Listen. hitting 100k. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh, all I coins, don't have all a substantial amount of money in, in Bitcoin, but I mean, listen, I want crypto to succeed. Like, I love, crypto, I mean, listen, right? listen, I, I love listen. The whole... well, to be fair, okay, Bitcoin, Ethereum, those are the only two like I uh trust, but at the end of the day, it's a gamble, it's a fucking gamble. Like, I mean, all stocks are gambles at the end of the day. Oh, yeah, yeah, like, wow, very smart. <laughs> 
I get yes. dickhead. No, no, dipshit. I, I get that crypto is much more volatile, right? Then why did you give that but, as a fucking counter? Like, I'm going to go buy a lottery no, ticket. It, well, shouldn't you invest your money? Oh, well, all investing is gambling. Just like a lottery no, ticket. I wow, hate so how edgy. People try, no, 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 no. I hate how people try to post crypto as some sort of, like, degenerate investment. It is. While they're still trying to fucking find some small startup to dump all of their money in, right? I, I think you're better yeah. off I mean, if you're trading your penny stocks, yeah, you're basically, you might as well go sell crypto, sure. I agree. Listen, when as many stocks are odd, like a Fortune 500 company, at the end of the day, listen, if my money could 10x in some sort of altcoin, I'd rather put some of my money there than all of my money in some stock that will only go up like 1% or some shit. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I say all of my money, but that's like, you know, two pennies and like a cum rack. But like if I had money, I would definitely do that. But I'll tell you this, right? Ethereum, I do like, right? Bitcoin is just a store of value at this point. It doesn't, it, it doesn't do much, right? But hey, real quick, guys. I like the altcoins. Vote for Tabor no, Snapper. Tabor snapping in this, okay? Vote Tabor oh, Pepper. Where is this? Vote, yeah, vote. It's this. a Twitter poll, okay? Guys, don't let Tabor lose. If he does, he's not going to have the money to tier 5 sub me. You where two, is it? Rumble chat. W whisper it to me, please. Whisper it to me. Wait, are you, are you sharing on Rumble right now? Um, There's nothing where it says. Yeah, hold on. Why can't I type in your chat? Followers only? Oh, my God. Cringe. Wait, my chat? Yeah. Oh, I'm not allowed to post links in your chat either. Oh, well, let me give you mod. What's your name? Uh, Destiny. Destiny. Okay, slash mod Destiny. There you go. You're good to go. Spam What's it this in there. meant to do? There you go, guys. Help Does he Tabor. get paid more if you vote on this? Yes. In fact, they're not going to re-sign him unless he wins this, so. Fuck, I can't click it. Oh, my yeah. God. This is close. 50.3 to 49.7. Oh, only 6,000 votes. Oh, come on, guys. We can guys, crush come on, this. Uh, yeah, guys, vote in this, please. Vote in this. Oh, also, let me just say, uh, Destiny. I like I came in one day and I told you you're terrible at picking people, and then the next day, one of your closest friends stabs you in the back. Like, what's going on? Well, and you're here next. See how long you last, okay? <laughs> Listen, here's the thing. Here's the thing. You can never be overly invested in online relationships you're at the end of the day you're always going to be acquaintances the problem with people is they get overly attached to somebody and they start going crazy and they start thinking why doesn't this person value me uh, of course they won't value they've never met you right you can't be too parasocial about these things wow. you got to keep a healthy distance okay like Come i on, know Rich. you as much as i know my barber and by the way i didn't cut my Whoa. hair in years so you know why I is it lagging at this point. is i know we were going to play some games today or is it just political bullshit talk, like always? Yep, just that. Oh, just full screen this bitch. Full yeah. screen this guys, bitch. Guys, guys, pump my stock. Pump my stock, okay? No. Also, Destiny, let's be fair. Yeah. Like, don't you kind of see how your relationship with most of these people that you talk to online is like a boss with his... I, I say people... You know, <laughs> like a boss, you said? Like a boss and his employees. Like, oh. I go on Chud's stuff from time to time, and I call him, like, the employee of the month, because, you know, he usually does well, right? Uh -huh. So, like, don't you see how that it comes across that way? Because, you know, they're sitting there trying to pour their heart out to you. <laughs> like, they, they see it this way, and you're like, mm, gotcha, where you're fucking playing StarCraft. You know what I mean? Like, you could give a shit. And oh. that seems like what a McDonald's, like, regional manager would do, you know what I mean? You know, there's a guy like, online that's trying to make that argument right now. We'll see how successful he is. Who's that guy? It's called Mr. Girl. Okay, it's why are you comparing me with that guy? The problem is he wanted to be something more. You looked at him as the side chick. He wanted to be the main chick. You know what I mean? I don't and know, then man. you drove him crazy. I, like, I feel like he was a little crazy before I ever got to him. I fair. mean, that's why you loved him. You need to take some sort of accountability for that. You, you saw the craziness and you're like, amazing. I want this guy in my life. But check this out. You, you should have realized that the man was a little too unhinged when he was like, I want you to be my friend. Would you be my friend? You were just laughing awkwardly, like, ah, we could be friends. Ah. Like, at that point, I bet you were thankful and grateful to God, in which you don't believe in that it was online. Because if this was, like, IRL, you'd think that he'd kidnap you or something. You know what I mean? Um, but you see where I'm coming from. I'm not crazy, right? Well, I mean, you can be crazy and still be making a good point at the same time, right? Okay, well, actually, how does this differ from when I said that crypto's volatile? Okay, you're stating the obvious genius, Thanks. right? What do you do? Are you still in school or did you finish? I forgot. I finished. Oh. Listen, I'm all in. I'm all in on streaming at this point, right? Yeah. It's either that or... <laughs> I don't know, actually. I don't know, actually, what I'm doing. But yeah, I just finished school. Damn. Wait, Can't what did you, you get a degree in again? 
I feel like you told us okay. this. I don't remember. I, I already told you. See, this is how I know we're acquainted. Yeah, well, just it's fucking clearly. remind me, motherfucker. Jesus, a lot of people come in and out of here, okay? Can I guilt trip you for a bit, motherfucker? Okay, go Holy ahead. Shit. Yeah, yeah guilt trip me. Yeah, my Thank bad. You. Go ahead. Okay. I poured my heart out and you weren't listening. I'm heartbroken, but it's software engineering. That's okay. Gotcha. Yeah, and yes, yes, everybody in chat, you're 100% correct. I have no plan. Like, I'm all in on streaming, okay? All in. If it fails, probably gonna be sweeping the ground in front of your house. <laughs> yeah. Maybe. Maybe. Probably. Who is allowed to declare right. a fatwa? Is that only like imams or can any like Muslim do it? Nah, any Muslim can't do it. No, it's usually the higher ups in Saudi Well, like, could you like theoretically declare one? If I became a Muslim, could I declare one? No. That's not how it works. It's oh, a hierarchy, you, you, okay? Oh, so not any Muslim can do it then. You lied. No. Wait, do you speak Arabic? Yep. Yes, I do. Wow, beautiful. I have to listen. I'm Somali. We don't speak Arabic in my country, but I was born and raised in the UAE, so I have to speak Arabic. Okay, it's part of the program. The brainwashing. They don't give you no birth. You don't have birthright citizenship. You don't get naturalized. But hey, once that assembly time comes around, you gotta fucking salute the flag and stuff. Nice. So is you like a cousin a prince or your dad a prince or like what is your how far are you from royalty? How far am I? I mean I do believe in the whole six degrees of separation thing so I guess I'm only six people away from all sorts of royalty but I have no royalty in my family. I, I, I have generals yeah, and stuff. Lagging. I have generals but that's, those are Somali generals. Gotcha. But I don't have any royalty and I'm not from the UAE you know that right? Wait how are you born and raised in the UAE but you're not from the UAE? You weren't listening again. Pay attention. I, sorry, I guess. Whatever what this game is. My bad. I'm a nice guy. I'll repeat myself for you. Yeah, thank okay. you. I know what you love to hear yourself talk, so go ahead. Oh, you got that right. That's why I'm a streamer, okay? It applies to all of us. But uh, there is no birthright citizenship, so you don't get the passport at birth, and you don't get naturalized. My mother was there since she was nine. My father was there since I the known country was nine years learn. old. It doesn't matter, you know what I mean? Wait, you so know, where were you born? I was born in the U uh, you fucking dick. Wait, what the I'll fuck? Wait, I just said born and raised in the, I said born and raised in UAE and you said no, that's not what I said. No, Wait. I said yes. I'm I don't know. Okay. No, I, I must have missed it. I'm born in the UAE. Okay, thank I'm you. Born in the UAE. Gotcha, okay. You're welcome. Also, Train, I have a question for you. How the fuck is everything lagging for Oh dual 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 nice? What's up, brother? Okay. So uh, when you were on the Hassan stream, you said some shit like I put four hundred dollars in and it was gonna turn into forty million. Yeah, bro. I, 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 I misheard you, right? No, no, no. I had a crazy sports bet. I had three separate tickets, and I made like it was like twenty five. It was like a twenty eighteen or twenty five like parlay, and I, I like I fully like went through and I looked at the teams and I made it and I bet five hundred dollars on each of the tickets. And each ticket would have came, like there's three tickets. One ticket would have won like 19 mil. The other ticket would have won like six and a half mil. And the other ticket would have won like 14 mil or some shit. I don't know what it was. Some wild shit like that. The point is, it added up like hundred dollars. Yeah, so it would have been fifteen hundred dollars to like forty five mil. I lost by one game, bro. If I was a, it, wait, so they were all connected? No, it was the same ticket. It was the three same tickets I made. Oh, okay. Okay, so one ticket can contain like a bunch of stuff in it. Okay, sure. Dude, if I was a Muslim, oh my god, I would get, I would be getting it so Ooh. twisted right now. Jeebus. You're telling me $1,500 could net somebody $40 million. It's not bad. Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, get it twisted. Gambling no, is don't get it twisted. Investment. Don't <laughs> get it twisted. fucking crazy. Don't get it twisted. $500? How many millions? <laughs> oh don't get god. it twisted. That, that is unlikely to ever happen as, uh, as it didn't happen for me. <laughs> Uh, he was only one leg off, ladies and gentlemen. 99% no, of yeah. gamblers stop before they succeed. True! <laughs> They're so close. <laughs> They're one more so bet. Close. They, they missed the mark by just the tiniest bit. You could be the difference, okay? At the end of the day, all Don't be like Slicker, watching, who fucking gives up, okay? Right before he hits dude, it big. He gave <laughs> up, right? You know the meme where, you know, you're at the tunnel, you're digging, yeah, and you we stop, know. We've like, all seen the meme. one hit away from the diamond. There you go. I'll tell you this right now, though. Oh, my God. Most of these streamers that you're Listen watching, to trainers, guys, talking about they all beat the odds to be streamers, okay? So they all guess what? what? If they did it, you all beat the odds, technically, right? You weren't meant to succeed. I mean, you started back when there was two streamers, Destiny, so you don't count. Okay. Actually, most of you guys started when there was barely anybody, so... I guess you know what I'm saying. These guys had it easy. But if I make it, ladies and gentlemen, then I promise you, I'll be get, I'll be telling all of you guys to get it twisted. Except the gambling stuff. That's how I'm don't do it. It's financial cuckoldry. Everything that I just said was a lie. 
Except that you could technically win, right? It's just one in a billion. Oh, but you've been oh. getting these crazy parlays, though. Like, I see you tweet about it sometimes. Like, oh my god, I just won 99 million from 10,000 Yeah, pounds. but I make it clear that, it, that I put, like, 20 of them in. <sighs> I got jeebus. I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to think about it. If somebody was putting that sort of stuff out there, even if they're telling me, yo, don't do it. Bro, I still fucking do it. I'm sorry. Like, the only reason I don't do it now is because I want to get into heaven. You know what I mean? So that, that's Wait, do you guys have, like, hell and fucking Islam? Is that a thing for you guys? Yes, we're not Jews. Oh, okay. Shout out to the juicers, though. Okay? But, yeah, we have hell and heaven. True. We barely Wait, have it in Christianity. Like, really. It's not, like, that talked about. Wait, Judaism doesn't have... Heaven and hell? I don't think I don't think they should do. Last time I checked. Destiny? Uh, all I know is that for Christianity, we it's like barely mentioned, but people make it a really big part when you go to like church and shit. But I don't think Wait, are you Christian? I was raised Catholic. Ugh. The real God. question is can I hit a max win? That's oh, the real question. What do you think? I don't know. It, a max win would be fantastic right. I mean, imagine right now in the heart of it all to just hit one win that encompasses all of my quote unquote haters' incomes in one year and <laughs> one day. What do you think about that? What do you think, think that's doable that? today, Dest? If you could kill train wrecks for gambling because it's so haram, would you do it? Would you get like 52 versions or whatever for it? Oh my god, you Islamophobic cuck. No, that's not how it works. Oh. That's fucked that's up. Why like would you even ask that, Destin? That's bad vibes. This guy was here defending. I posted <laughs> this some funny. Said that's bad vibes, dude. I posted a few that? funny pictures on fucking Twitter that this guy even knows are funny, and don't this guy came in pictures. and he defended. Don't say funny pictures. He this defended people that were sending me death threats for weeks. I, no, no, you're being a white woman. And Stop he's being like a fucking white woman. What? You're a white guy. Stop being a fucking white woman. What I said was, you oh, don't you deserve death threats. He's worse than a Karen. He's a Becky. He's a white woman. He's a snow bunny demon. Right? Come on, to now be, you don't got to that white To be fair. Girl. To be fair, Becky's might be crazy, but they give some great head. Come on now, I'm fasting, it's Ramadan. But like, let me tell you this, boys. Let me tell you this. The fact that you tried to paint me that way shows me that you might be actually like, you know, an hermaphrodite or something, you know, like intersex. What? Like, you Is might that what be hermaphrodites do? Because that was so feminine of you, I'll tell you what Would happened. Would that be I... bad though? What if you could fuck yourself literally? Oh, get the Bro, you just told me I should jerk off. Maybe you should jerk off if you think about fucking yourself. I can't believe well, Train actually this. knows what a hermaphrodite is. Nice. What are you trying to say? I'm stupid? Bro, you think I'm dumb? Bro, no, that's just a really niche fucking right? sexual term to know exactly what it was. Brother, bro, it's he, because... He, 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 bro, Pornhub, okay? No, it's not Pornhub, brother. There's a, <laughs> there's, a fish, there's a fish on the ocean that uh, reproduces because it's a hermaphrodite. And You're talking hermaphrodite, about horses, right? And it... Right? It... Uh, Changes from male to female. It carries their own baby, right? It it, 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 it has eggs and it, it, it like releases seahorse. its own sperm into those. It's some shit like that. No, no, it's not a seahorse. It's a, uh, it, it's like a something horned fish. Or a, I'm pretty a, sure it's a seahorse or horse fish. One of them. Seahorse or horse fish. But I don't know. I'm not a, a fucking clown fish. fish? Right? No. Okay. I'll no, it's not. It's not a clown fish. It's like a. It's a blue. It's a thick blue fish with two little. No, it's like a vampire fish or some shit. Which fish in the ocean is a hermaph hermaphrodite? Let's see. Teleosit fish? What's that? Anemone fish? Dwarf angle fish? There's a whole bunch of them. Oh my god. No. Oh, there's sea a whole horse. bunch of them. There you go. Seahorse. No, get it's not. Pregnant. It's okay. No, no. Males carry the young. I, I, do they also? Do, do they also get pregnant? I don't dwarf know. fish? No, it's not a dwarf fish. Which? Wait, Fish are hermaphrodites in the ocean. Oh, what do you think about uh, your good friend Mitch Jones coming out and making some statements? He's never publicly attacked anybody. Do we have a train wrecks press release statement on this? What happened? I'm still looking at this fish. <laughs> What's the latest train? How's it been, homie? Uh, pretty good, man. You know how it is. Uh, you know. Typical bullshit. Mm -hmm. You know how it is. I sent you a message today. Do you still check DMs on uh, Discord often? Um, sometimes I'll take a look at it. What, what was it regarding? Just kick.com stuff. Take a look at it after stream. Yep. Yeah. How are you doing? Yeah, you know, I'm staying busy, man. Just uh, well, not staying busy. Looking for stuff to do, but 
you know, yeah. relaxing. That's good. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know how it is. Just the, uh... <sighs> the life of me. Did you just fart? Why would he oh. fart into his microphone? How do you I hold do your mic? Time to, I do that from time to time. Really? Yeah, my my farts sound very ASMR-ish. But, bro, the average age of this call is like 50. All of you guys are in your late... How old are you, Cortanos? Like 21. Okay. Call me Q from now on, please. It's Corantos, but call me Q. Um, 23. Oh, wait, like like the Quran? Like Corantos? No! Bro, I already explained <laughs> Destiny. You don't fucking listen to me, dude. I explained every single thing you asked me. Like, okay, are we going to keep just... repeating this no, every no, time I... Cause... Brother, it's Dan obvious what here. his name's around, Destiny. His name's Cortana. You know from Halo? Oh, like Halo. You're a Halo no, fan. No, yes. you fucking That's in uh, Windows 10, right? Or Windows also, 11. Yeah, yeah. Oh, also, right. I never, I, also, I never played Halo, okay? But check this out, right? Uh, it's from Toronto, uh, Somali for lizard, because I used to be like inc incredibly skinny. Like I made anorexic woman look fat. So, so what does that do to call lizard? lizard? No, no, my parents used to call me lizard because I was so small and skinny, and it, but, I could probably fit in between cracks and on, on the floor and stuff. Yeah, but uh, I would argue there are th doesn't fit because I'm built like a man, you know. Yeah, but there are things that I think are, you know, like, you know what? Fuck it, <laughs> whatever. Oh, you lost your train of thought. No, just. Of all the things to like equate to something that's skinny, like what, like lizard is the last thing that my, my mind would go to. I yeah, mean, that I is guess it's, weird. Right, like I mean, like, it's uh, fair. I, I I guess it's cultural, right? It just depends on where you're from. No, but but lizards aren't skinny, like propor like like proportional to yeah, their. Are they uh, even? Like, why wouldn't they call you like gecko or something? Like those are kind of skinny, right? Okay, well, okay. First of all, where I grew up, there's a bunch of lizards. Right, there's no fucking gecko. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I don't know what a fucking gecko is, but everybody use Geico, okay? Use fucking... Geico. So you know what a gecko is, what do you mean? <laughs> he does know what a gecko is, he's that's lying. That's what a gecko is. That, that The Geico guy is literally a gecko. That's what yeah, a gecko is. that's where I know like. him from, but I don't know what a gecko is. I've never, But that's like, what a gecko, a gecko is. If you know what Geico is, How do you not know... How do you not know what a gecko no. is, but you know that the Geico guy is a gecko? No, I... No, I don't know what a gecko is, as in I... If you were oh, to tell oh, me, oh, point out oh, a gecko, oh, I don't know what a gecko is. But I oh. assume that the Geico guy is a gecko just because of Geico sounding like gecko. It's a pure guess. Uh -huh. I know how to put two and two a together. Pure I, guess. Did, I actually, yeah, I did I did an IQ test and they were like, your your IQ is off like the range. You can't compute it. So I, please, come on now. Yeah, it's because you can't divide <laughs> by zero. <laughs> it's, it's not because you can't divide by zero. It's just you can't get to a number greater than infinity. You know what I mean? Get it right. <laughs> okay. okay, let's ask... Let, let's ask... Uh, Dan, come on, answer me now. Don't be a coward, okay? You're like 90 years old. You don't have much to live for at the end of the day. You could say whatever you want, okay? It's a few You're words. really trying to get your fucking streaming shit going, huh? Like all the memes and shit? How long have you been watching Destiny to know all these things? I promise you this. When I went on Zerka shit, they tried to claim the same thing. I don't watch any of you guys that much. Don't flatter yourself. You watch right? a you fucking You knew my middle name. <laughs> you know, no, I'm no, starting to get a feeling you might be a little bit of a pathological liar. What is going said, on here? By the way, by the way, uh, I have an answer to every single thing. First of all, your name is literally one Google search away. You put destiny name, it comes up. You put train wreck name, it comes up. You, like, it, it, it's that easy, okay? You're saying you if you type in train wrecks, the second result is train wrecks Dan? No, bro, the first thing I figured that comes it out. up is Tyler Faraz name. Dan, Destiny, Dan, Destiny, I figured it out, bro. What'd you yep. figure out? I literally was taking a piss. I, I figured out what's going on here. All right, hit me. This is Slicker with a voice changer. <laughs> oh my God, I will fucking... <laughs> bro, you, I swear to God, they call me Slicker, they call me Zerka, they call me Too Mad. Bro, I'm fucking Carantos, dude. What the fuck is wrong with you guys? And by the way, uh, Slicker... It actually does have a lot of Zerka vibes, actually. Like, I'm hearing it now, as you say it. Like, I didn't I didn't get it before. It's like a, a tremendous... Yeah, you're you're trying to antagonize me. I and... actually hear more of a Moxie. Really? Yeah, so like, just listen to his voice, like like the, the, the end of each sentence, the end of his each word. It sounds like Moxie in Overwatch. Guys, don't talk speaks. about me like uh. I'm dead. I'm here. Don't say he. I'm right here. Okay. No, don't little bro me. Okay. I'm I'm six foot ten, boys. I'm six foot ten. Don't. Do I'm this. telling you, I, I I don't know why I feel a Moxie vibe. I'm gonna be honest. Mm. I don't even know who the fuck Moxie <laughs> is. So. Hey, he continues to do it. Uh, I, okay. I'm not Moxie. I'm not Zerk. I'm not Slicker. But well, you know something I that Slicker and Zerka do, and that you do a lot, is you come in here and it's like, okay, it's Zerka time. And that's it. And no other conversation could be anything except about Zerka or what Zerka doing or something that Zerka cares about. And I've, I've noticed, because I've seen some streams of you on, that you 100% do that as well. You got to chill with that, bro. That's okay, not a good okay. thing. There's already okay. 
big Zerka in the room. We don't need little Zerka. You gotta be yourself. Okay. You can do well, first it. of you all, you didn't see happen. you didn't see when I killed Big Zerka, so you should probably go find that video. Number one, okay, the old king is dead. Hail all hail the new king. Ooh. Number one. Number two, you cannot claim that I make everything about myself, or else you're claiming that your good buddy over here, Steven, just sat with somebody that talks about themselves for three hours straight. That's not true. Yeah, that that's but that's that's not saying anything. He fucking will have. Bro, like I wish a, I could get into CS too, bro. I want to play some CS. <laughs> Steven would have like a fucking noisy washing machine talk to him for three hours if he could just play his game. I'm trying to make some CS too. Listen, bro. if I was if I was able to maintain somebody's attention for three hours talking about myself, you're complimenting me right now, okay? You're glazing. You're glazing. Uh, I'm going to so, a bonus so, as well, bro. What's up? Tell me, CS two is that? So is that 100 percent going to carry over with all your skins and shit? It is. CS1? Yeah, it is. We're good. Really? It is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good to go, and and, and skin prices are rising too. Not saying that's a good investment. You shouldn't uh, see that. It's also a gamble. Get it knows twisted. No. Don't get it twisted. That's right. I just have um, a wild inventory, so I'm happy with that. How much is your inventory worth in CS? Oh, yeah. Uh, roughly like two mil. Let me USD. let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. So yeah. I know that because I, I did like a very small amount of yeah. CSGO gambling. Not because I give a shit about CSGO. It was just fun to do. But... um. My understanding is that a lot of the quote unquote big sales of CS shit go through a Chinese site. I think it was called like Buff something or other. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. The real question is when you say your inventory is worth two mil, like, like you're saying something like, okay, I have a factory new Stat Track Howl that's worth forty thousand dollars, or I don't know what it's worth, but you know, as an example, right? Uh, for those high ticket items, like maybe like a factory new Dragon Lore or something that's Stat Track as well. The real question is, can you actually go and sell those high ticket items easily? Like, I know it's easy to go and sell like a factory new Karambit, uh, like, you know, one of these 500 to like $2,000 um, knives. Like you can sell, sell those all day, but it seems like the really high ticket items, you don't see them get sold very often. Like you could, you have a $2 million inventory, but if you need to liquidate that, how much can you really get without taking six months time or something? Um, I'm not sure because I, I don't do that. I, I just collect. You're I'm not just really collecting, in, purely. I'm just collecting, yeah, yeah. I, I'm not selling anything. I, I just like to collect. Interesting. What For is now. the, um, back, I feel, God, my memory is shit with this. I think I remember back in the day, someone, got it, was it Soda Poppin? I don't know. They got a souvenir factory new, um, I think it was M4A1 Knight or something like that. Like, is there some really insanely rare thing that people don't talk about because it's not that desirable, but it's actually really rare? Is there any of those items like that that should be priced a lot more? Like, what do you think should be priced a lot higher? Give me a sec. I need to reset all this. I don't know what's going on. I feel like the prices must be dictated by drop odds, right? And people must just know. No, it's well, supply no, and demand. It's, 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 the, ba it's the same... Like, it's relatively the same economics as real life. There we go. I fixed it. I had to relaunch. The... Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it just comes... Yeah, I don't know how to answer that. I would have to bring a uh, CSGO specialist in here, and, and they would answer that question uh, for you. No, I, I don't care that much. That's that's fine. It's no big deal. Just talking to you about your... So, what else... Um, so, what keeps you busy? You're like a billionaire now. Um, so, what do you do besides spending millions of dollars on CSGO? How else is Train spending his money? I don't see any Ferraris or anything. So. I don't really care. If I, I'll, I'll be honest. I don't really care. Uh, like this is going to sound completely wild, but um, I don't view money in the way others do. Even when I was broke, I didn't view it that way. Like, don't get me wrong. Like, obviously, having it's nice because it gives you the ultimate freedom. All I care about is. So I guess I do care about money, but I only care about it to the extent of being able to just like sit back and game and just like sleep in. So, it's, so it's, I don't care. I don't care about the partying. I don't care about the, you know, uh, uh, jewelry or the cars. You know, the, the one car I did buy was more of a fuck you to these large streamers, you know, of Twitch that were buying cars and flexing it on the poor people. So I bought a car to flex on them. Right? They, they were all buying like four or five hundred thousand dollar cars and like posting it. Like it's one thing to like really love the car and be passionate about it, but it's another thing to buy it just to like say fuck you to everybody. So I bought a car to say fuck you to them. Right? They bought a six hundred k car. I bought a two million dollar car. So that was Wait, kind is of that how you justify it. <laughs> What yeah, I bought, it, I bought it just to buy it just, just so I can post it, right? And say, <laughs> fuck you guys, like pussies. Like, why the fuck are you flexing on poor people? So I decided to flex on them and give them a taste of their own medicine. But realistically, I don't really care about it. Uh, I got a, uh, a 2021 uh, 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 SVJ uh, 63 Roadster. 
Jesus. By the way, when you say juice up, this whole time, like, I know this may sound ignorant, but I swear to God, this whole time I just thought, like, you're doing, like, a bump of coke. No, I'm but just... Is it, like, like it's, it's vape. vaping? I'm just a vape, yeah, just, it's just vaping tobacco, yeah. Or nicotine. Like, spray. listen, I'm anti but I, I think it would have been nice if it was coke. It would have been cooler. Like, you're telling me this yeah, entire time... Yeah, I agree. Like, juice up, it's vape. Like, you're just vaping. That's why you're I don't do it on stream. On that's why I don't do it on stream. Cause, yeah, that, that's why I don't do it on stream, because I, I know it's, like, I'm... You're like there, are, there are, yeah, there aren't many things I'm embarrassed about, but that I am completely embarrassed. It, it's 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 a loser thing to do. It's a fucking loser thing to do. Like out of all the loser things that I do do, like I own them because you know I genuinely like them. This I don't even like, but it just takes the edge off, so I just do it. So you're so addicted. I, just, I mean, if I were to say no, you'd call me. You'd say I'm in denial. So for the sake of that argument, I'll just say yes. <laughs> okay, whoa, don't destiny me. What the fuck? Yeah. Like, you you just said it takes the edge off. You said it, like, that's like an addiction takes the edge off, right? Yeah, people that like, smoke yeah. nicotine are addicted to nicotine. That's the whole point of fucking. Yeah, yeah like, yeah, so it's not like I'm arguing with you. Like, you just be lying to yourself. I can't argue if, you know, you don't believe that. But do you, do you pee while you sit or stand? Uh, most of the time, sit, but uh, there are moments where I stand. What? Oh, most of the time, sit. Interesting. Yeah, I think How it's many people do that? Nice, nice. Wait, do you, uh, please, ya Allah, ya Allah. Do you wash or do you use toilet paper? Oh, yeah, um, it depends. Yikes. You're telling me you wipe your ass with toilet paper. Yes, but if you shave your ass, there shouldn't be much of a trail anyway. No, bro, okay. No, yikes. <laughs> yuck, 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 yuck. You didn't know yuck. it was going okay. there, did you? Okay, okay, check this out. No, it's actually, I've never heard that comeback before. It's, it, it shows me that you've put some thought into this. If a bird were to shit on your arm, would you pour water on it or would you just wipe it and move on with your day? Tell me what, we, what would you do? When a dog takes a shit and comes sits on your couch next to you, do you uh, wash your couch? Am I fucking retarded to own a dog to begin with? I'm putting Satan spawn in my house? If you said a oh. cat, I'll talk to you. But at least cats, you know, at least they have the shame to, like, bury their piss and their shit and, like, whatever they do. Well, that's even worse. Their paws are hitting, you know... No, it's hitting sand. It's not hitting the shit. Cats are actually what? clean. Dogs are dirty. But... Yeah, but you're clean not a dog. is a relative Last time term, I checked, right? they're not a dog, right? Last time I checked, they're not a dog. I, spo I said human, and you're like, if a dog shits and sits on the couch. Dogs are nasty. I'm talking about you. If a bird were to shit on your arm, wouldn't you get some water and okay, actually well, clean it off? To, to use your same comparison, I'm not a bird either. So why are we using a bird comparison? No, but it's oh. no, but like I'm not worried about the bird's asshole. I'm worried <laughs> about your dirty hand. Just like your asshole's dirty when you're done with it, right? So it's like you wouldn't wipe it with a tissue. I, I listen. It's cute that you're trying to run away from this, but you're in a corner right now, so <laughs> like you need to help me or something. Get DQ. Yeah, no, I'll help you. I mean, I mean, I'll humor your question for a moment. That's why I tie my shits to be before a shower. Okay, Ew. dude. Fucking get a bidet. You're a trillionaire, there, dipshit. Like, get a bidet. That shit costs like $2. Like, you could put it in yourself. Why, why wouldn't you just get a bidet? But I do, I, like, I've heard a lot of people do what you just said. So you do understand that it's disgusting. Even, how, like, no matter how many times you wipe with a tissue, like, you still get up and you're like, ugh. Okay, so you know? do you fart? Yes, I do. Okay, so, so you realize... That that smell you smell are shit particles entering your nostrils, right? Yes. Go on. Uh, let me so, see what you take. So, so what I'm saying is like <laughs> you're not being consistent, right? Like, like. <laughs> the fuck out of it. Don't hit me with the consistency. Well, well, you're not. Argument. Like, what, what you're saying is <laughs> what you can see and imagine on your ass. You're applying, but in reality, when you fart, right, the particles are hitting your underwear, they're hitting your ass cheeks, they're f coming up, and they're actually entering your nose, and yet you find that to be completely normal. But then you have an issue with your ass, which is covered by underwear and your pants. It's not like you're making contact with it while you eat. I'm not fucking slapping the hamburger on my ass cheeks and then putting it in my mouth, right? <laughs> True! <laughs> this is my argument. Okay. I swear to God, he no, no, looked no, at this no, for no. me. Right? No, let me, let me I did it. Against that. No, no, let me argue people against that. People will do this thing, like, oh, well, if you shit on your hand, would you just wipe it off? No, but I don't shake people's <laughs> hands with my asshole. Even if I used a bidet, no. I wouldn't shake people's hands with my <laughs> asshole. But it's still fucking disgusting if your asshole's dirt and you're walking around with shit booty. It's still nasty. Until, no, take no, a but shower. Is like, no, no. But, bro, just wash your ass. You're telling me you take a shower every yeah, time. Yeah, I do. I take a shower shit. and wash my ass. I, I do the fucking uh, the hey, karate Here's a question. If a bird shit on your arm, would you just use water? Would you soap it too? I would soap it. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Quantos. No, 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 no. Destiny, nice one. Destiny, what nice else? one. So do you use soap with your bidet? Do you soap out your ass as well? <laughs> uh, but no, 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 no. i tell you this. I'll tell you this. If I, if I could, fuck it, I would. You know what I mean? But I, I'm not used to it. 
Okay. That's the only like thing that you could like hold me on. But at the same time, like obviously, water is way better than tissue, and soap soap plus water is way better than just water alone, right? So you you guys still lose because you guys don't even use soap. You don't use water. You use tissues. You're disgusting. But at least some of you have the the shame to say I take a shower after I shit, which is very hard to believe. Like you know, and also the shit water running down your legs. Yuck! 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 yuck, yuck dude. What it, brother? Shit, so nice. Shit. Like, I think you're, listen, I think what's happening here is, right? What's happening? What you've done now is you've told me you have an extremely hairy asshole, right? Because- Okay, okay, I've never shaved my booty. So what? Yeah, but I don't, I'm not, like, I, I'm not, I'm not, even if I don't shave my pleasure. asshole- You're hairy as fuck. I'm not. Dude, look, this is my natural arm hair. You look said look the camera's off, but okay, let me go. He's on his stream. Camera's off. Just go to my stream. This is my natural arm hair. I'm, I, like, for some reason, I'm not, a, I can't even grow a beard. I'm not a hairy Persian. Like, even my chest, bro, like, it's, it's not that much hair. That's weird, because Persian guys usually have a real fucking carpet that's going what I, That's what I was They thinking. do, yeah, like, I-, I, oh, I wait, have, show me your arm, I, show me your arm now, show me your arm. That's my natural arm hair. It doesn't grow any longer than this. Okay, I don't shave so my arm. E okay, so we're equally hairy. That means your booty's not even that hairy, because mine's it's not, not that hairy. Yeah, it's not, but, like, so it's just not the issue. But don't get me wrong, like, I do think, yeah, like, a, a bidet is definitely, like... I do think there is a day where the bidet will be the new base minimum, which is a good thing, right? Like, like I, mean, I don't so know. So you agree? You agree with me? So why not just buy a bidet instead of showering every time? I think it's well, I don't, brother. Like, the, an, a healthy shitter shits one time a day, not fifteen times a day. So you just shit, you shower, and you're good. It's not like I'm taking fourteen shits a day, <laughs> right? Okay, I'm not taking... uh, no, okay, okay. That. Oh, okay. I have a question for you guys, right? So when you when you have diarrhea, you're using the tissue on the diarrhea as well? Bro, can we is move it... on from this fucking conversation, man? Bro, this is better than you asking about fucking cars, dipshit. Right? No, I'm actually really is. interested in this. No, I'm actually I, I, really I, I interested I bet in you this. are interested in this. No, I'm because not surprised I, no, about no, that. Because, no, no, because, you know, Destiny was talking about God bless the worst, you know, the morally superior, righteous, you know, highly advanced, intelligent people that are not reproducing. Like, we're so much better than the rest of the world. But at the same time, for all of your advancements, you guys couldn't figure out how to wash your ass. Like, I'm so dumbfounded by that. I'm like... That, this doesn't make any sense. Like, these people that are flexing to be the most intelligent in the world can't figure out, hey, your hands is dirty, you wash your hands. Your ass is dirty, you wash your ass. With like, water. It's a logical fucking... Yeah, fair, but guess what? Water is better than tissues. I still take the water, and hey, guess what? I'm not shaking people's hands with my booty. So water is good enough. Because at the end of the day, I'm just washing away the dirt. And if you shower, and by the way, showering once a day is crazy. That's too much. That's way too much. Like, un unless you're sweating like. Alright, once a day is crazy. Thing. Yeah, it's crazy. If you, I've had friends that shower three times a day. Like, I almost Jesus. fucking committed hate crimes on them. I'm like, what three the fuck? Three times just... a day? Yeah, because they're fucking insane. Yeah, One but you're gonna crazy. have like some issues with like your scalp. Your skin's gonna dry you out. Like, a lot do of if issues. You, if, yeah, you already do if you shower once a day, though. Your hair is now is getting dry and it's getting used to having yeah, water. Yeah, the natural oil. Yeah, the I'd agree, there but. You go. So why do you do it every day? Do, like, because, you yeah, so much the proper the way to do it is, no, the proper way to do is, in my opinion, you can shower every day, uh, once a day, but you just shouldn't use shampoo every day. You should just, do you, right, your, do you change your clothes every time you shower? I do. So, uh, that's, that's, that's the reason I can't, bro, it's too well, much. Yeah, but, yeah, but ever since, like, if I even step outside with a pair of clothes, or a set of clothes, sorry, I, 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 I have to take it off and change it when I come back home. Ah, uh, you're that paranoid. It's like a habit I've created. No, just just from the days. It's just like that's like forever ingrained in my uh, habits now. Dan, you can keep talking about cars right now, okay? I promise I'll stay quiet. Yo, Steve. Yo, y'all add the the embed yet for? Add the what? The embed. embed. For what? Rumble or kick? Kick. Um, I think on kick we're waiting for support for something called iframes. But I don't know what are you if embedding? Kick, kick might not like it. I think I've heard Train say something about it. they don't want embeds or something, so I'm not sure yet. No, they don't. They don't care. Oh, the crazy thing about Kick, it seems to be going so much better for small content creators than bigger ones. I mean, I like the clip stuff, the TikTok clip sort of. Um, real yeah, it's gonna thing. be great. Oh, I gotta show pictures. I like that of idea. Uh, I actually like that idea. 
I don't know, like maybe bigger bigger content creators will benefit more from it though, since you know I, I'm assuming the algorithm will benefit. Yeah, but I you yeah know, the ones with more likes and stuff, right? I, I went over that earlier. Yeah, we're uh, right now we're in the process of oh dual dual dual. Oh my god, we're in the process of figuring out how we can uh, even even the playing field for everybody. So instead of like just popular clips being uh, like brigaded to the top. Um, it's more of a, obviously like th that that audience manipulation or whatever you want to call it is always going to well i guess i shouldn't call it manipulation because it's just gonna be a passive effect it might not necessarily be a negative thing or like in intentional in that way it could just be a passive effect to a larger audience but we're trying to find a way to even out so like all quality clips will get pushed up how yeah, we how do, do that judge quality that's the question right yeah how so how we do quality? that so I, I guess quality would be like so maybe quality is the wrong word, but what I mean is like, let's say there's a popular clip in a smaller community, right? So like, if their clip were to get the attention proportionally to that, to that community size, right, that would get juiced up to this, right? So, I mean, the problem is this can be abused, right? So if you're a two viewer streamer and let's say all two of the viewers like it, that's going to be weighed more than like a, you know, 10,000 out of 16,000 liking it. So that would be an easily abused system. So that can't work. But these are things we're like discovering and exploring to figure out how we can even out the scale to give small and mid-sized creators a benefit from that algorithm and not just the large creators who are going to have passive audiences juicing their shit up to the top. Does that make sense? Yeah. Like everything you said makes sense. But at the end of the day, it feels like to me because I don't, I don't know what the final solution would be, but the <laughs> more you, sure? you try to look out for smaller content creators, the more you're fucking over the bigger ones. <laughs> that's the, well, that's what it comes down to. There is like a common misconception in that, like, and I've been seeing people misunderstand. Like, I think, like, I think using the term smaller creator is being, uh, I think the better term would be hardworking streamers. So streamers who are grinding, putting the work in. Because it seems like all these small creators are coming in now. Like, like I'm seeing like, ugh, I'm, I'm getting ads with at like, these motherfuckers have like four followers on Twitter and they have no brand anywhere. Hey man, can I get verified in a sub button, man? Like I've been grinding for two days. Like what the fuck? Two fucking days. Like put your head down and work for at least a year. Like the fuck between two days? Like, like it's, it's crazy. As soon as you open that up and you say you're trying to take care of small and mid-sized creators, people's like entitlement, like, there, there is no like decency Bro, in the I don't know if it's the same no. as it used to be but the worst people on Twitch used to be like uh, Twitch streamers with like 10 to 50 concurrent viewers on Twitter do you remember those days I don't know if those people are still yeah. popular anymore but oh Th that's my what I talk God, about bro like bro Bro, they bitch about it, Destiny, and then you go to their channel, they've streamed one time in three months. Yeah. Like, the fuck? Oh. Yeah, okay, okay. One, okay. one time's pretty good, though, you think? Like, one time, what if it was, like, a really good one-time stream? Like, you know what I mean? True. If you, got, if you got 50 viewers in, like, your first stream, it's full screen. See you're killing it. But uh, when you say small to mid-sized content creators train, right, what do you mean by that? What's a small well, content creator to you? Well, let's change the hardworking. Okay, it's hard work. Here's, now, this is what right? Train wants to do. This is the difficulty of what you're trying to do. He's trying to create an algorithm that isn't just weighted by how popular you are so that it's not like the, the rich get richer, right? It's trying to yeah. benefit people that don't have the same viewership as like a four-figure member. So maybe somebody that gets like 150 concurrent viewers. But you can't just weight it by like percentage of viewers because somebody with a much smaller viewer base might have a way more statistically engaged viewership. So somebody with like 15 concurrent viewers would get 100% viewer participation in a clip and it would be upvoted to the top every single time. So they have to create exactly. like a, they've got to balance an algorithm out that favors disproportionately smaller streamers while still taking into account the fact that statistically speaking they're going to have a more engaged audience just because of the lower numbers and that's a yeah, challenging thing to do yeah i understood that but right now the more that i think about it the more th that i think like is that really a problem like if you have somebody isn't the point of creating this clip system to get the smaller guys into a position where they no longer can benefit from it so if you're a smaller content creator and you get 10 to 15 viewers and you have 14 of them like your clips and now your clip is at the top and you go to 100 viewer and then you know your advantages decrease as you go up in viewership isn't that yeah like but the problem is the on their system to... they probably don't want to create something they want to have funny clips clips shouldn't just be like socialism for small streamers where it's like oh yeah like if you're a small streamer yeah. like this is how you come up you want to have it okay. so that like clips are funny right okay but if we go off of what he said right what train said the hard working streamer right shouldn't it also weigh in the algorithm should it also weigh in the amount of clips uploaded by the streamer no, so, like if they, so for that, there's going to be a limit on how many you, how many you can upload into that algorithm like system or into that TikTok like system uh, per week. So obviously, right, wait, if why? it was unlimited, because uh, like that's where like logistics come in. What are we going to have each streamer uploading ten thousand clips 
uh, every no, but fucking week. Hard, yeah, but you just say hard worker. Like the way that you, like, how could you quantify hard work then if it's not by the amount of clips that they post? That's that shows hard work. Quality so, quantity. Quantity. Hard Wait, work what? So hard working means clips posted. So, so you're telling me no, if I stream on Twitch and you grab clips from my channel, like if, if I stream for six hours, you can grab arguably an infinite amount of clips, right? Like how do, no, how no, is that a problem, representative no, 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 of hard working? Okay, the problem is. Destiny just said quality of our content, but when it comes to quality, the way that you could gauge quality is by the amount of people that liked it. But you want, but what you're saying is, I can't go off of by the, the amount of people that liked it because big streamers will just have a lot of people like their stuff, and then you know the system. No, no, skills. listen, Small just streamers listen. Can benefit. Listen, listen. Do you believe? Okay, if someone put a clip of you in front of everyone's eyes, that like, let's say if someone could put a clip of you, evenly. You know what? Fuck it. Let's use Reddit. Someone put a clip of you on the top of Reddit. Do you think you do you believe that that clip would hit? Everyone would find that funny, would love it, and like it, right? So the issue is, how can you get everybody a close to equal, uh, uh, um, like representation to have the chance to be viewed by everybody, right? So it's about giving everyone the chance of that exposure, and then the people can determine the quality, right? So th th that's what all these algorithms are, right? On TikTok, when something hits. Right, no, it, it yeah. injects itself in some sort of system. Something just takes fire. So it's about giving the, everyone the opportunity of that. Right, we're not gonna like, right. You can't force that quality. So it's just it's about giving everyone the equal uh, exposure to the opportunity of getting exposure. The problem with that is you're talking about the TikTok algorithm, which benefits off of people's engagement, such as their comments and their likes. And you also recognize that if you were to do that with your algorithm that you want to implement for your clips on Kick. Then it would just favor the big streamers because once they post their clips, their community is gonna like it, it's gonna engage with it, and they'll still we maintain just, the top spot. We, we right? just explained that. No, I know, but what I'm trying to tell you is, if not by that metric, which is likes and comments, you can't measure quality that way. You guys are saying it's all about quality, it's not about quantity. How do you measure quality? If it's not by likes and comments, how could you measure quality? I guess we're gonna have to figure that out, aren't we? That's what I'm trying to say. Like, I get what. You, that's why I, I thought of, hey, maybe it depends on the amount of clips that the person posts, and if they post ten clips, then maybe you put one of their clips out there and see if people, you know, engage with it and like with it or that's like. That's the fuck exact with it or not. same thing we're saying, right? Giving people the chance of that exposure, right? No, but it's no, no. But you said you, you, you know, we want to make it limited, the amount of clips that you could upload. That's what you said, brother. I need you to think about this. What's <laughs> like? I, I'm, I'm so confused by your logic. So you're I telling tell me what you're confused by. Go. D Destiny, do you understand like the <laughs> I understand what you're saying. I don't know what he he's like on some weird like limit. Yeah, I'm confused like thing, wait, 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 what, what the saying. fuck what the fuck is insane about what I'm trying to say? You guys are trying to say, "Hey, it's all about quality." I'm like, "Great. If you don't want to measure it by the amount of clips uploaded. If you don't want to measure it by Brother, the, the likes amount and of the comments clips uploaded. Like, do you understand how, like I'm I, like it like my brain hurts. <laughs> no, no, I the, get why you by think the it's amount not of because clips people uploaded. just do you, you don't understand have it? any alternative, you know that, right? You, you what said do you, you mean? just have to figure so it out. So you're telling me it should be based off of everyone's moderators clipping constantly and uploading into the system. That would saturate the system to the point of zero exposure for anybody, and that would favor the large creator at that point. No, no. That system no. you're talking to only favors large creators. Only. Okay, wait, wait. Think about it. No, it's okay. If, if every that, streamer on the that, platform uploaded 10,000 clips a week, who do you think is going to get the exposure there? I get where you're coming from. It depends on the amount of people that you have watching you, and the more people you have watching you and clipping you, it still goes back to the big streamer. That's a fair criticism from you. But yeah, you so we're trying, and, to, and we're trying to no, no, we're trying to tackle how can we give everyone an equal chance of that exposure, right? So that's what we're trying to figure out in the coding and the algorithm uh, okay, uh, there, okay, part okay, do you have, of the okay, formula. Okay, great. You understand? Okay, great. Now, okay, now we're coming back to square one. Steve, <laughs> okay, dickheads. I'm trying to come up with something, okay, asshole. Okay, good. They well, have a whole team fucking... working on this. Why are you trying to work for for free? Let their fucking people figure it True. out. No, listen, you're a trillionaire. I'm, uh, what the fuck? I'm doing slave labor. But listen, Steve, you're fucking laughing. How about you come up with a suggestion? I, it's not know? my fucking job. I don't work for them. I'm not gonna sit here uh, fucking when you, brainstorm. Okay, when for... you can't figure shit out, when you can, I, dude, it was a fun exercise. Oh, but I'm just bad. trying I to say, like, I've never. In, okay. Listen, I've never in my life. Listen, if, if you figured this out, congratulations. Because last time I checked, the vast majority of algorithms on social media operate off of comments, likes, uh, shares, all that sort of stuff. They operate off of all you sorts of stuff. I'm pretty sure different. on YouTube, August would know, but I think on YouTube, I think that they what they measure now the most is like time spent on site. Like they want you to click something and keep clicking through and engage more with like certain types of content that keeps you like actively engaging with the platform. Yeah, but God forbid you, your, your clips are limited, so... 
you know, a guy clicks on your shit and they won't have much to go through. So that in itself is cucking the content creator in a way, but, wow. you know, that's just my suggestion. Like, if you guys can figure it out, congratulations. Thank I you. hope you do. Don't say thank you, Dipshit. You're not working for him, remember? Oh, that's you weird, because it seemed like you were trying to have me do free labor for the past, like, hour for him. So my bad, I got Okay, come on. Okay, could you, uh, could you please come up screen. with something? Could you please come up with something, Steve? I already gave a suggestion, Did but I'm saying it's hard. I, I'm not, I'm, I don't know how to What is the that. suggestion you gave? I didn't hear it. Say it again. That you would have to wait using a combination of like Please the concurrent screen. viewership of the person and the active engagement that that person's fans have with the clips and everything, right? Uh, but I don't know how you would yeah, wait. But, yeah, but Train, but Train immediately said that that's a bad idea because- What are you depends. trying to do right now? Hey, trying to figure out the clip system. Huh. Steve, Steve, yeah, train, to I, train is talking about on kick they want to have some kind of organic way to promote clips on the site so that people get more exposure but they can't do it based on raw number of views because that would only favor the most popular streamers but they can't do it as a percentage of the fan base engaging with it because that would obviously disproportionately favor smaller streamers because they can get a more engaged fan base so how do you get these clips to go viral or whatever and like benefit all the streamers oh, but it's like such a minor thing in the grand scheme of things I don't know why this quantity honestly, it's, it's, honestly hold you on wait 100,000 followers thank you guys it's um it's it's based on what I did back in the day is you took the size of the community and the expected growth from that and then you work that into a factor for doing it. So like a really large streamer you might get 10,000 whatever likes on their content and a small streamer might get 100, but you take that expected value and you work it off of that. So if a small streamer instead of getting 100 gets 400, you look at that more seriously just like if a large streamer would normally get 10,000 they get 40,000. So essentially that's how you would do it with that front. Yeah, but I mean, we that's just how went over that though. It, it helps the smaller content creators a lot more because if you have 10 viewers or if you have 15 viewers and 10 of your people engage with it, it will help you a lot more than if somebody has uh, a thousand viewers and let's say it's very 70, easy. 100 engage with it. It's very easy to, to make these systems if you've been there and you've done it. It's not complicated. Ooh, you have little small bro. exclusion stuff. Okay, that, yeah, yeah. The kick steam is getting shot on. That's not my business. He just little bro the yeah. fuck out of you. Are you going to take that? He did little bro the fuck out of me. He, 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 he little bro the fuck out of kick steam. No, he's little bro you. Listen, they're a new, not, yeah, first off, they're a new company. Nice. So there's a lot to figure out there. See, like, it's he just little bro you again. Easy. Okay, at the end of the day, my suggestion was the best. Fuck you guys. What I said is bite the fucking bullet and just allow the smaller content creators to grow. And when they, once they get to a certain size, they can't benefit off of this. I think what they should do is I think the smaller content creators, if anybody makes fun of their content, they should go online and then threaten to kill those people. Kind of like how the Muslims do it. That's why you guys have the fast growing religion, right? Isn't that what you said you're supposed to do? Hey, that's why we have, that's why we have kick and bumble, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. But dipshit, listen, listen. Yeah. You, Wait, you keep bumble? trying to bait me as any, you keep trying to, huh? Did you say bumble? No, I said rumble. I mean, oh. same thing at this point, right? But listen, <laughs> Steven, dipshit, stop saying that I fucking want you dead. I don't, okay? If I, I did, I wouldn't be in a call with you. I said, like, if somebody trash talks, your... they deserve to get one. Yeah, right? okay, true. Listen, I'd be, like, I'd be planning okay, streets okay. and stuff. I'd be watching your clips to learn how you did it with that other DDoS kid. That's it. Base. That's what I do. Wait, do you know Mr. Girl? Do you follow his saga? Uh... Is it I've Saga or it's Saga? Just because of all the people. Saga? I don't know. It's, it's, saga. it's Saga. Trust me, it's Saga. Shut the fuck up. No, it's Saga. Uh, I've heard of him from, like... I know him as much as I know the left little chick, basically. I just know he <laughs> likes kids, kind of. Okay. It's a bit weird. Just curious. No, but you love him. I, you, I already brought him up to you, right? You love him. You platformed him because you thought he was cool and he had, you know, takes that were out there. You love those sort of people, I guess. True. That's why you're you here. are a viewer, bro. You are. You, you know all the lore. Listen, Zerka tried bro, to where, say the same thing. Tell me thing. this. Where's Kyle? Videos. That's all I want. Do you know where Kyle went, Carantos? I don't know. I don't know who Kyle is. But <laughs> yeah, you might know. Kyle. Yeah, okay, dude. No. Okay, Dan. Can I can I tell you something? I the only reason I know as little as I know about like Zerka or Destiny is because I watch YouTube. That's it. Like I just I watched know. like two scuff podcasts and like a couple of Destiny debates, and that's it. Like you guys talk a lot, you know that, right? Yeah. You're you got, okay. And it's and it's easy to remember the shit that you guys say. Is that it? Because like, we're authority figures. No, it's because you talk too much. You know, eventually when somebody speaks so much, you know, you, you remember a couple of things. You know. How, how All right, you say your final this? thoughts because I gotta leave pretty soon. No, I was having fun. Well, Train, do you own part of Kick? Like, what's the deal there? Uh, I've, uh, I haven't accepted anything yet, but when I do, I'll let you know. All right, man. Because you're an authority figure, Dan. He'll let you know. 
I am an authority figure. I built one of the largest streaming sites in the fucking world. I was the second Damn. biggest site compared to I, fucking I, Skype bro, at the time. I, wait, I cannot wait, 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 believe you're one of the owners of Tiny Chat. One yeah. of the owners. The founder, wait, CEO. You were, I was there. Go no handy, relax. Take the fucking wait, compliment. So how much money? So so you got money when you like so you got money when it was sold. Yeah. How much money did you sell it for? Like a billion dollars? Fuck no. This I is way was back before dollars. anything on the this, internet was worth a billion dollars. <laughs> It's 150 years ago, man. Uh, no, it's, I, I don't want to say how much, but it, it's don't not. Tell me you got ripped off. Did you get ripped off? You know, it was good for where the company the company was at at the end right there. It was going through interesting times. It was very expensive. It's not like now. Well, even now, it's you were actually you're the, built. You're the owner of Tiny Chat. I created it. I was the founder and CEO of Tiny Chat. That's wild, bro. I was literally a. Uh... That's wild. That's yeah, and you're, you're like you're talking about. I'm. It's funny because I watch you talk about like the struggles that you go through with shit like Kick, and it's like, you know, granted it was different back then, but we had like a yeah. hundred thousand concurrent viewers, but it was like much more spread out. And having to deal with that shit was like fucking crazy right back then because the technology was nowhere. I mean, you know how it was like streaming back in the day. It's totally different world. So, cool. yeah. Okay. All right. I love you guys. I gotta read a thing and then. What the fuck do we need to go? Where do you have to go? <sighs> My gym closed at eleven. It's our fucking reunion, and yeah, you're well, going to the come fucking earlier gym? before fucking seven o'clock at night. Okay, wake up Jesus or stay awake. Damn. Christ, bro, are you fucking kidding me? Yep. I'm leaving to run on a treadmill, by the way. Let me just say. Bro, that. Who the yeah. fuck else can we get into a fucking call and talk? Dan, you have any ideas? Uh, no. I don't. But, um, yeah. Wait, wait, Dan, I got a question for you. Did you sell Tiny Chat for less than train gambles in one stream? All right, uh, here, Ayla wants me to look at the server if you want to read it. Can we not read the article? No, we don't have to. Um, we'll just do it tomorrow and I'll leave. Have fun. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace out.